What did you guys do? What do you guys think Hold of on. that? Hey guys, we're here at the record games to beat Judgy. We've even got our Judgy shirts on. He's judging Rory. I'm judging Merlin from Merlin's old school garage. And it's gonna get crazy. Crazy! <laughs> I will make it my extra goal to be extra, extra judgy for all of you people. Extra judgy. We're doing the intro stuff. I got my first bribe. My spotter is Jimmy. He's my sidekick. And I picked him for a spotter because you've got to see him right Cheers. There ain't nobody freestyles like this guy. Rory's already bribing both of us, to, and I'm not even on his team. He wants to bribe me to work on the other guys. <laughs> and then who's this guy? Never heard of me before. Matt Bleeping Geek. I've already got my first bribe from Rory, but I want to open up all the bribes to the audience as well. <laughs> I drank Dr. Pepper. <laughs> so we've got Colt from Bleepin' Jeep. Extra Jeffy. <laughs> Do you think a cash bribe would affect your judgment? Only if it comes from the other teams. <laughs> He's got a roll as well. Watching. The dino, the I'm watching too. Alright, here to judge the paint. Let's see how they did. I don't know about what you guys think, Everybody but it looks a little MG runny to me. Merlin's oh, not on a sticker. Pull the proofs. There you go. <laughs> Well, since I'm judging Merlin, his first thing is the RTI ramp. So we're going to see what he can do. Because of the year of this truck, I'm not seeing any seat belts. Is there no seat belts in here? Okay, cool. So here's the deal. I'm gonna level with you. There's no seat belts. I I have a rule in this, and it's you know it's kind of like uh, when you get your FA FFA briefing as you get on an airplane. You know they teach you how to buckle it. Yeah. If this door is open, it's already too late. You should have been out. <laughs> So I guess I just have to have my door handle ready. I recommend if you're not out on the first roll, wait till the second to go ahead and try to exit. <laughs> Just flexed it on Leafs. That's 27 points. I think we will go one million points. <laughs> one million. No links though, so you get zero for that. <laughs> what, what was our RTI number? What's the RTI number? Looks like. 793. 793. Well, I put 1, oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so what's the corrected RTI from the three judges? 1,000. 1,000. 1,000. I think we all put 1,000. Oh. 793. <laughs> <laughs> Judge all this awesome so I can give money right out of my pocket. <laughs> exactly. Don't do any dino pulls just yet. How many points off if you don't fit on the dyno? <laughs> Alright, so here are my judging criteria. 
for the dyno. We have Sounds Cool, Buff Horse Powers, and Dyno Results. <laughs> First we gotta see if he can even get on this thing. Uh-oh. What's happening here? Uh, I don't think he's gonna fit the way uh, they want him to. They'll fit. They'll just have to pull these jacks up. Mm. How many times do you think they put a tow truck on, on the dyno? <laughs> Never. I asked Roy, I was like, have you ever dyno this thing? He's like, nope. <laughs> I don't think it's meant to go very fast. I don't think so either. All right, so Rory had to air up the inner tires, deflate the outer tires so that he could hopefully fit on the roller of this dyno. I don't know if that's going to work or not. To me, it seems like if he does that, puts it at high speed, the outside tires, which are low, are going to expand and start hitting the deck. That won't be good. Because when I'm raging through the gears, I don't want it to grab and take off that away. <laughs> Is it going to clear? Sure. If not, we, we're really willing to turn around and, and do it in front wheel drive. They got it strapped down. We'll see what happens here. I'm standing back. <laughs> you guys are way <laughs> too back close. to see a launch, I think. I want to step back a few hundred yards here. Oh, I just I got another like bribe. A, a judging contest. You got to tell me who this bribe is for. Well, the man here, Rory, the king of Moab. Who else would it be? For? <laughs> All right, that's two bribes. That's that's about five bribes. That's the good one. Oh, I even got oh a with cream a koozie soda on. with a koozie. Yeah, koozie. All right, we'll go for three. We'll go for three. Yeah, that truck was not built for these size people. Yeah, not built for big men. Okay, so I guess we're migrating to uh, welding. Welding? Welding. Which is up behind Paul. Have you, have so. you ever done that before? I mean, have you really yeah. ever done that? Um, I mean, are you going to be winging it? I worked at Welder Up in Las Vegas, but it was fake. Yeah. Yeah, it was, it was for TV. Yeah. <laughs> I've got kids, my friend. <laughs> you should have had them weld that for you. <laughs> I did. I know. What is that? What is that? That's the way we want. Oh, is that gas? You want to cut it for me? Are you already done? Do you need a grinder Are you or a welder? I came over to put some pressure on you. You can't weld and grind, right? You can't help. I can't help. No, you can't help. All you can do is handle. All you can do is try to get in his way. <laughs> and they say bribes don't work. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I think we both died. <laughs> so, us judges, we decided to help each other out. So I put 43 points for looking cool. Rudy only gave Merlin 25. I just want you to know that. I didn't know it was for Merlin. <laughs> I would have given him more. It looks so cool coming across the beach. 125 <laughs> just happened. <laughs>
obviously they want they feel like he's gonna be the judgiest. I'm gonna have to be more judgy. We're gonna be more judgy. Yep. You're gonna try very hard to out judge me. Yeah. I think we have to sell something. Where's Hunter? Hunter, are you how paying good? people? How, how good do you want him? To these got these are Merlin's judges. <laughs> yeah. How good do you want him to do? Now Merlin is not a good welder. Oh really? How, how, bad how bad of a welder is he? He's pretty. He's bad. terrible. He's terrible. Terrible welder. If you were to put a number on how bad Merlin is, what is how many? Yeah. How many points do you want him deducted? Because right now I see seven. Seven points deducted on his welding skills. That should keep me in the game. Seven should keep me in there. Okay. So. so if you didn't hear that, Merlin. That's not how I work. You don't know my judging. I just want you to know, on camera right now, in front of the world, that your opponent may have put money towards a, or against you. That's nothing. You should have seen what I did for his judges. <laughs> so in the welding competition, you have to have two parts. You have to weld together a trophy that could possibly be yours, that I'll say last place. And you actually have to weld a piece for a strength test to actually see how strong your weld is. And Miller is here testing it out. So what is the secret to a strong weld versus a pretty belt weld? You know what? All welders say the same thing. Be a farmer? More heat and a longer rod. <laughs> <laughs> this is what kind that of candy can. I like. I like green. the green, the green how are, paper bag. How are my judges? Okay, I think they're going. They're getting better. They're getting better. We are definitely the bottom next. Uh-huh, I see you. <laughs> No, the dino is. The okay, good. Yeah, don't sweat. <laughs> There's a problem. So but I, I've, I've remedied I figured that. confidence was, should be uh, up there anyway, because word on the street is you drove yours out here. I did. I did. I did drive all the way from Lake He's Havasu, the only one that drove it here. 360 miles. <laughs> towing my Jeep. So I was... I was having a hard time coming up with a number value for confidence, so I just put all of it. All yeah. of it. <laughs> <laughs> you get your two points of deduction. anything last anymore. Place never looks so good, to wait for Marvin. Hey. Come back. I'll take last place with a homemade alternator. <laughs> the whole world just found out. No hey everybody, we're back. We're the Germany team. What do we, what do we got? I know you right. Colt the proof. Because you're all here for us, right? <laughs> Colt just, just named the first loser. No. We had a Robbie Don't Layton, but it got hot and burned up. Don't worry. You still like you. What did we break? Uh, and that's off road on tomorrow. Hey, if you do. All right, we came over here to the RTI ramp. Looks like BSF is going to give it a shot. We're waiting on him. Let's see what he's got. Look at that. He's using the dualies on the rear to gain an advantage by putting it to the outside. Good, sir! Yeah. You're better than that. You can do it in one shot. I've seen this on YouTube once. <laughs> How many zeros are we tagging I'll on? I guess I'll put there? 17. Do that. I, I didn't have get any ones. That's sorry. Pocket, so <laughs> I don't see that at all. Question is, is there ice in that cooler? Uh, feel it. It's not iced, but it's cold. Oh, they didn't do their homework. They didn't I know, do their I know. homework. We're... Plus two points, minus one point. I'll give it to you. Right on. <laughs> Thanks, bud. Lit. All right. And then you're done. Judges can score, deduct however they want. Just remember style points. You can roll it any direction you want to, side to side, bumper to bumper. Oh. How long does it have to be on its wheels? You can't, you can't rip it all the way through in one yank. Ah! Like there's gotta be a delay. It could be milliseconds of a delay, but there has to be a delay. 
All right, guys, so the next competition here, Rory has to flip this thing over. It's mostly based off style points, so right now they're determining how they want to go about that, whether they want to go side to side, end to end. I've suggested that it come completely off the ground. That would be my favorite. Let's see if they can make it happen. That was very successful, but I don't know if that had any style point. I mean, since we're here. Okay. Okay, it's hard to get up into. Cup holders. Let's check. Well, use the, use the steps. There's chain steps there. The Let's check the levelness of your grab bar here. It's definitely not easy. I'm ready back here. I saw that you installed cup holders recently. See? Just for my Dr. Pepper. Yeah. Very nice. It's happening. <laughs> oh my gosh! Dude, stay out of the rest of the Sorry. Oh my gosh! No warning! No warning! I'm a terrible runner, I don't run! <laughs> truck has no seat belts. It's pre-seat belts. It doesn't have seat belts. It won't have seat belts. And it doesn't have a roll bar either. No roll bar, no seat belts. This is a hold on to the door handle, hope that it opens up, jump out if you got to truck. <laughs> Look at all the insanity here. All these people came to watch five wreckers compete for the ultimate name of not being the worst wrecker. What do you think? I think this Mountain Dew is nice and cold that I got from the Trailmater team. We'll see what the tow mater team can do for us. <laughs> Roy's been buying us all off the whole morning. Yeah. And I am not above that. Yeah. Yeah. I gave 100 points for Skittles. I've been getting a lot of Skittles. Yeah. I see a big stack of money on your clipboard already. Oh, yeah. They're, they're, some are for and some are against Merlin. I'm just going to tell you that now. Where we've been apart doing all kinds of crazy stuff all day. Um, but this is insane. The amount of people here is just crazy. Well, that's definitely not short of torque. Yeah. Let's make a giant tower. There we go. We got a tower. Will your box stop us from being able to get it? The kids are building a sand castle to stop Merlin being able to pull blue steel and the more bear. So there's nothing to it.
that for you? That was awesome. I was walking back. I could see it jumping though over all the fans back there. <laughs> jumping over the fans. That's amazing. How has your experience been here for so far today? This is great. There's so many people out here that showed up to see us. Thank you guys so much. We couldn't do it without you. Awesome. Thank you. We've been cold. How's your neck and back after that second round? It's okay now, but my head hurts pretty good. I only hit, I only hit the ceiling about 48 times. Wow, you were able to count. That's called a concussion. I was wondering how the ride was. I got another bribe coming. Who's this bribe for? You. Huh? Who's this bribe for? Who do you want to win? Marlin after yeah. that pull. That is first place right there. That was so entertaining. It was awesome. Part partner's got whiplash, but he pulled uh -oh. it. <laughs> Thank you. Exciter, an influencer, if you will. Yeah. And if you could influence the, the crowd in our favor. Yeah, you want a little bit of excitement? Yeah, maybe just a little. Yeah. I got you. Thanks, bud. I got you. I think it's time to bring out the beach ball. All right, look at this guy. I don't know if I have enough hot air. Oh, you got this. You got this. Yay! Yeah. Okay, you guys ready for this? Another bribe. Alright. I'm gonna run out of pocket.
my uh, my judge. How did we do? I mean, you know, we didn't do anything spectacular and leave it all up in the air for for the neighbor. But the next uh, guy, we I get, got it I done. Get, well, it said look cool. Did we so look I cool? stood there and looked cool. You did look yeah, cool. Yeah, I tried. I did my best. <laughs> I agree. I did my I best. The smoothness. It was one to six. So you got six. Nice. It could be a seven if uh. But there's more Skittles Get some somewhere. Other Skittles. Skittles. Where are they? Come on. Skittles. Step up. He shouldn't have That's to ask. The problem, the problem with the Skittles is they're, you know, they were kind of shocked when we hit the end of that rope. <laughs> 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 they went for a ride. So Merlin's so confident, he said he'll take everybody's horsepower numbers, everybody's torque numbers, add them all together, and he's going to beat them. That gets confident points in this. Down low, what's going on right now? Okay, so because we broke our transportation, hey, that looks if, like we, if we make that dyno pull, <laughs> so if we make that dyno pull, we're just going to shell dry train all over. We're going to oil the dyno down, and actually, it's kind of dangerous for the dyno. It's really, really a bad deal. Understandable. So what I've done. Uh, this industrial, motor is the exact same. Industrial Injection is one of my sponsors. So they've got the exact same motor in this truck. And I think it's only fair. I mean, I could have switched my tires out and made it fit on the dyno and done all that. So my dyno double, which is bright, uh, grandson of the founder of Industrial Fuel Injection, he's going to dyno pull for me. And I'm pretty certain that he is going to make more than three times the horsepower that all of the other contestants have, that all the other competitors have made them on. So what I think they were, the number was like 500 or 4 or something. Total? Total. Ah! <laughs> 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 
Honk honk. Man. George has a big Jeep, but now he wants a little Jeep. 42 yeah. miles an hour. What? Yep. Give it a shot. That man. Yeah, try it, man. It's way quieter than I thought it was going to be. That's good. That's very good. Guys, it is day two of the record games. Rory's crew is getting this thing ready to be towed up the mountain. All of the spectators are heading up there. So we're just waiting to see what happens here. What's the correct tire pressure? Um, I'm going with 15 today. 15? Oh, wow. 10 in the front, 15 in the back. What's your job? Are you the holder? I'm the holder. We got the wrong fitting on it. <laughs> we forgot our hose at home. Oh no, you left the hose? So we're, we stole the FJ air hose, but like everything, it's got the wrong end on it. So. Yeah. <laughs> so somebody came by our booth yesterday and said, we have to buy one of your stickers because Paul dented his truck. <laughs> I don't think it repaired the tail light though. <laughs> We might need some of them later too, you never know. <laughs> somebody somebody bought them all already. We didn't bring enough band-aids. Well, we didn't realize how uh, sketchy you guys were going to be. <laughs> Merlin broke his case last night, but went ahead and spent all night putting it back together. Okay. Yeah, we got you guys umbrellas. And All right, we're getting more bribes here. We got us some ponchos. Okay. But we got you guys some ponchos. Oh, look at that. So that's gonna you be, guys got rain ponchos. That's going to be a lot better than my trash bag. See, we, we take care of our judges. <laughs> and then we got you some hand warmers. <laughs> that's going to be really warm, really warm. Yeah. Hand, hand so my guys have fun. But well, we'll have all this on the truck for you all. Whenever you need anything, just let us know. We got Dr. Pepper. We got okay. Dr. Pepper. We got Mountain Dew and Diet Mountain Dew. All right. <laughs> I will be having some of that. I hope they have restrooms out there on the hill. Things are about to get nuts. We are driving up 
into triple sevens right now and it is going to get crazy i believe this trail is rated an eight which is pretty tough for a regular vehicle and we're doing it pulling a vehicle crazy I never expected it to be this big. It's yeah. crazy. Holy <laughs> crap. Look at that. Mountain up there is just full of people. Oh, we got some cheating going on here. Look at this. <laughs> hey, this is Pepe. I just want to make sure everybody knows we're all out here to have a good time. Let's make sure we give the wreckers plenty of space and the trail vehicles. Keep all of your vehicles off of the trail as best as possible. Um, we're saying 25 feet, at least 25 feet away from the wreckers, okay? Thanks, let's have a great time. So here's Chuck, and he's got the PA system on the top of his Jeep. Does that mean you have to do the trail too? Yeah, with my turtle shell on top? Oh yeah. <laughs> Those are the PA speakers. They are very, very loud. What's your plans today? Go along for the ride. I'm here on the brakes. Stay alive, yeah. right? <laughs> yep. I'm trying to decide if I need to put my seatbelt on to keep me intact or to not so I can jump out. Well, 
I'm in a truck that doesn't even have a seat belt, so I'm just jump out always. <laughs> All right, I'll stick with your plan. Okay. You guys ready? Very ready. Always born ready. <laughs> have the most experience where where where'd our this, judge go with this bridal setup what yeah. is, what is it that everybody else is doing wrong here um well they haven't done it for years <laughs> <laughs> the 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 hard bar yeah doesn't work i i have this argument so many times with people on the internet they try to tell me that i need to have a sling a traditional sling that'll keep the vehicle from you it works on fire roads and dirt roads and stuff like that on an actual trail it does not work. You have to do a soft setup. You have to. So just and to let you know. I don't you know. care how long people have been towing. I don't care. I don't care. Come out here and show me I'm wrong. Just to let you know, you're the only one that didn't just totally mess up the hood and the front and everything. Everybody else was like crunch, just right, metal like, to metal. Like everywhere. I said, our our game or our our biggest selling point is. We get your vehicle to you in the same condition you left it. <laughs> so we're trying to do that with this. Well, I can be bought. Rory's gonna have a real hard time. I can't say. I can I can say that if Rory ever finds out, he can buy it back. He can buy it back. So that was the battery charger for the blower that Rory's been using to blow off all the sand of the obstacles. <laughs> we are turning it backwards because we only have front brakes. So when it lifts up off those hills, it just goes. There was a brake line that was cut, so we're modifying. Who do you think sabotaged you? Um, I'm not saying any words, but it might have been Paul. <laughs> He's dropped the line, so he's not picking them up anymore and just gonna have them roll down holding his brakes. Give it up for Rory, everybody. Oh. Alright, now he's got this slick hill to climb. Check this out. Looks like he's letting out the, the line.
Look how much line he's got out. He's probably 20 feet behind him at this point. That seems to be Rory's strategy. <laughs> I see Colt and he is not he is not in the passenger seat. Why aren't you in the passenger seat? Well, he's went off to the edge like three or four times. He's pulled he's pulled about four feet of air. And it still doesn't have a seat belt and it still doesn't have a roll cage. So I figured I'd just hang out here and visually watch from the outside. <laughs> I don't blame you. <laughs> Where have you been all my life? Let's hear out some of that. Out on the opera. mountain. Out on the mountain. Where on the mountain? Here on the mountain. Okay, that's all I got for you today. That's all you got?
did that nice and easy. <laughs> I'll right save it for later. Right. There's not enough porta potties out here for me to be drinking these all day. But thank you. Who's this bribe for? For Rory. For Rory. Yeah. All right, that's one more for Rory. Thanks. Right there before it rolled, or were you out no, back there? I was, out. I was trying to get his truck through this, not really worrying about this, but he doesn't have hydraulics on his boom right now, so he couldn't lower it. Oh. So it was all way on the rear, so on the edge, about lowering the car, and it's like, okay. <laughs> That's why he did not do that. Yeah. All right, can everybody move? Rory's over there assisting. I don't. Is this legal? Yeah, get four points Does he get way, I guess. extra points, I guess, for helping <laughs> other teams. Look at that.
get you right there. It's about to break off. Keep it this way. truck and we you know what we made it halfway up a lot quicker than Paul I <laughs> just but you heard it here first <laughs> but we're only halfway so who knows if we'll make it we're trying Robbie has also thrown stickers on top of every person's vehicle shirts hats anything it's like he came here with a horde of stickers and just slaps them on stuff I only brought 10,000 stickers that's all, just 10,000. How good, how good can you test it with a football at your face? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I come prepared. I have a sword too. I yesterday. That was done. Oh yeah. <laughs> Richard Sherman over there trying to stuff you out.
gonna be extra judgy, so I'm hoping you're going this way, right? We're going this way. All right. Don't wreck. Yeah, no promises. <laughs> I ain't in charge here. <laughs> a couple points. You didn't see that. <laughs> you didn't see that. It was already there. Uh-oh. You can see the right front's hanging up on that rock. to help Paul. Taking this so seriously. Yeah. yeah. I don't actually have an answer for you. Some <laughs> days I wake up and I'm like, yeah, let's do this. No. Other days I'm like, no, this is a joke. You're dressed up for a serious occasion. I stick out, is what you mean. <laughs> well, we got Rudy, we got Paul. Okay, well, I just saw you too, well, here, hang on. Let's look on this side of the stack. Oh! I'll trade two of those for what I got in my pocket. I got two things in my pocket. There's one. Bucks, I don't oh yeah, no, we knew <laughs> we knew you guys were stealing those. Here's two. Yeah. Yes, dude. <laughs> hey, we got some some fighting power again. You're back. We're back. <laughs> I can tell you, I wasn't paid enough. 
<laughs> Do you have another drink back there? All right. Yeah, yeah these are yeah. these are not leaving my yeah, sight. Yeah, that cost me a lot of money. <laughs> we knew you guys were stealing them. We just didn't know who had gotten them. <laughs> had brake problems, so now he's been going backwards this whole time, having to look behind him.
I don't know about that. <laughs> safety in there. That is not good. <laughs> Yo, Cole, you need a first set on the way or something? <laughs> I, I knew who I was riding with. I brought like three of them. <laughs> right there except for Matt they're gonna continue this direction double Sammy is up there at the chute is gonna be our last obstacle I believe but we've got a few before then setup he's yeah, able like to it. manage his winches free spools from inside the cab so he's got this handle that comes all the way down to the winches he's able to put it in free spool go up and then lock it back in and then winch the vehicle up that makes it a lot nicer than some of these other guys have their setups it's difficult for them to free spool out because they have to winch it out basically or not at all which is the case most of the time here I'm not going to go on record. Oh, no. Yep, I'm not going to go on record.
factor just went up a million when I just realized now this thing has a Bellevue winch on it. <laughs> Most people don't, don't even know what that, that is, is, but I do. I yeah. Know what that is. <laughs> yeah. I noticed it right away when I saw the cable cable actuated drum. I was like, no way. Alright, one of the things I have to get as a judge is are they a good dancer? Let's see your dance moves. Give me your quickest well, ones. I mean, which one are we doing? Are we doing a little bit of the stand line, stand line? There are we, we doing a little bit of the spring glitter? <laughs> <laughs> to be on height on your dance moves, let's see it. <laughs> let's see it, what do you got? Oh my gosh. This is my dancer. Horrible. She is my dance move. Throw him down. No. Dude, she didn't even tag her in. Bust it out. <laughs> my dancers. <laughs> so we, we just We're lost pretty that terrible contest. in the dancing department. <laughs> One of my judgy things is your dance moves. So let's see them. What do you got? One of my dance moves? Yep. Let's just do the lead. <laughs> All right. I don't know how to do dance moves very well. I'm an old guy, but you know, we're good. <laughs> How's right. that? That was perfect. <laughs> 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 All right, guys, we are at the shoot. This is the one that you always see on videos of people climbing, and it looks intense, super crazy, almost impossible. But sometimes it's because they tilt the camera like this. All right, Sean, what do you think about being the first person to be towed up the chute? I know, that's pretty wicked. It's gonna be cool. Uh, I don't know. It'd be awesome. Check it out. Stay tuned. <laughs> Here we go, let's hear the play-by-play from you, Marvin. This right here is already really tight. We're going in there, and the goal will be your hands. Did anybody hear him? Let's 
into that. What a showman. He pauses up, right. up top. Ready for this? Another day in the office. All right, I'm going to sneak out real quick because that tire ain't letting me. You ready? Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> A true man to his word. You got your belt on? This is the end of the record games. We appreciate you watching. We had a blast. I want to come back and do this every year. We're going to have to do this. We are going to have to build a wrecker, I guess. Oh, man. I don't want to build a wrecker. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we'll have to have the samurai games. 
Yes. <laughs> or the cheap Dodge freewheeling games. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys like this video, check these out. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.